can't believe oh it. Oh my gosh, she has teeth or something in there. Welcome to BTR Outdoors, and on this episode, we are going to install an AC to this camper on my truck. That way we can go camping during the summer in this Texas heat. So keep on watching, I'll show you how I done it. All right, just gonna get some measurements. Okay, then we'll take a measurement of on the bottom here because I want to be able to come over it and kind of secure it the best it can. All right, excuse the mess, but what I'm going to try to do is have a board that goes from this side to this side, and then from the bottom of this, behind the tailgate, the very bottom, all the way up to about right here, I want a complete board going across, and then when I close the lid, it's going to be somewhat secured, not airtight, but somewhat secured. And then in that board, I'm going to cut a little hole out to put my AC, and they'll be able to set right here on the tailgate. That way I can go camping when it's hot, kind of like what it is today. But that's my plan. I think as far as the board, I'm going to slide it down in between here and the pickup. I'll probably have to take that off and it should slide right down in there and if it needs secured we'll we'll figure that out when we get to it but there is some holes there I might could possibly use all right but that's my plan is how to install an AC to your truck camper it's about the only way I really can figure it where I can take it on and off and just be really simple and like I said if I can just slide that in um, the wood piece that should be about perfect. All right, let's see if I got some wood that'll fit that size. I think I come up with 57 5 8 by 21. All right, I need to cut just a little bit off the side to make it uh, slide down. It's kind of stuck right now, but that's the general idea. Let me go cut that and we'll see where we're at. I think I'm gonna take it off a little bit more. I think a lot of it's just, uh, Sitting right here. All right. I slid in there still got some issues over on this corner right here I think I'm gonna have to notch around this for it to go in that shouldn't be no problem this side fits pretty good and we go to close it we'll keep working on that and see what's going on all right, well, we're making a little bit of progress. All right, I notched it out, and that's what it looks like. Still kind of lock it. I 
raise it up that's what it looks like that's what it looks like from the inside and what I'll do is my plan is about right up in here is cut a hole for the air conditioner set it in there so it's sitting on the uh, the back end sitting on the tailgate and then I have plenty of room I can install that AC and stay cool kind of have my bed over here and uh, have the AC right up in here so now I just got to measure where I can cut it and see how big the AC um, hole I need to be and then we almost got this beat All right, I did have to take out these little uh, plastic pieces just so it uh, slide in but I'll keep those so I can put them back in but other than that it's lit in not too bad I think this might work okay I measured my AC and I did cut the uh, hole for it right now I'm just going to um, clean everything up kind of sand it down and uh, just do a little trimming on a few places and uh, kind of get cleaned up and then I might even paint it I'm not for sure yet but I know one side's already uh, get a good primer on it. it's brown um, I'd like to paint the outside maybe red to match my truck a little bit better but we'll see and uh, let me uh, grab the sander and let me do a little sanding all right got it cleaned up it's really um this particle board's really hard to sand but i got it smoothed up i'm thinking about going to a local hardware store and getting some red paint tomorrow we'll see and uh i tested the uh ac and it fits so we'll just have to make sure it fits in the truck camper but there we go almost got it just kind of make it a and this is kind of like my prototype if this works um, really well then I'll <clears throat> grab some better wood uh, take my time a little bit better and uh, try to make it a lot better maybe put some insulation on one side this is just to see if it's going to work all right let's get some paint or not you'll see in the next video okay sorry for the noise or my air conditioner's on so i did go to the little hardware store and got me some uh some red paint i think it's called uh apple red that will seal this wood kind of make it match a little bit and so i'm going to paint this up and i'll show you what it looks like afterwards Okay, this is the AC I bought for the truck camper. It's just a GE 5000 BTUs. I think that's how you say it. It's 5000 something. I think it cost me about $150 with my military discount. Got it at Lowe's. So that's going in. Let's put it up, um, put up the wall right quick. Okay, there she is. It's a little tight going in, but uh, it had to be like that because when it pops in, it gets a little loose, but that's on the set just fine. 
All right, let's get the uh, AC in there. I can see a little light around the end of it, which I can probably fill that in with something. And of course I'll tr trim that two by four. So it's not taken up the hotel gate. And then to get in, I'm just gonna crawl over the top right now. I really didn't want to cut a doorway because I, I really want the security. I want it a, a solid piece for now. Might do that in the future, but like I said, it's a prototype. I kind of see what's uh, going on and how I like stuff. But that's how she's set up right now. All right, let's get everything uh, plugged in and see how she works. One oh nine. One oh nine. Yeah. Okay, the temperature is one oh nine point zero. All right, we'll come back and check it in a little bit. Okay, I got it set up and going. Going down the cab, and then we'll see how cold it really gets in there. That's what it looks like uh, from the inside of the uh, truck camper. I do have it set on high coal almost all the way up. Like I said, it was 109 degrees in here um, before I started the AC. Right, so let's see what the air coming out of the uh, AC is. Zero. Sixty-seven point six. That's the air coming out of the AC. Now, where I took the temperature at one hundred nine was at the back. I'm showing 85.5. So I've been in here eight minutes and it's already cooled it down to pretty comfortable. I'm not even sweating. So I think it'll get down, uh, you know, once it gets dark and you're sleeping, I think you could probably turn it down. But that's a pretty good uh, decrease in temperature from 109 to, what is it, 85? in eight minutes. So this little thing shouldn't take too long to cool down. I do have a little vent if I needed to vent air. So, and you know, this thing is not airtight either. So, but to go camping um, during the summer, do some fishing, just enjoying the outdoors and have a, a place to cool off and have a good night's sleep. This is a perfect, perfect way to go. Okay, we've been in here about 15 minutes. Let's see what the air temperature coming out of the AC is. is back where it was up. I took the temperature in the back of the camper of the truck camper it was 109 let's see what it is now eighty three point seven so it is going down I think that would be very comfortable to spend the night in stay cool especially if you uh Sealed up some of these holes and even uh, park this thing up under a tree. If you could get your truck in your camping area where it's uh, under a tree, get some shade because right now it's in direct sun. 
don't think you could even get it cooler and I think it's gonna go cooler as the evening uh, goes on and I think this will work perfect all right and also don't forget when you're making this is once you get your board in here and you're making the cutout for the AC make sure you come in here and kind of draw lines you can see some lines that I drew just to let you know um, where you need to, to make your uh, cuts where the AC will fit. I, I probably could have moved it over to the uh, side a little bit more, but that works out pretty good. All right. I'm excited. I'm ready to go camping in the summer in Texas. Okay, even uh, kept the cutout. So when I don't have my AC in, I can still cover it up. And I just kind of popped it in place right there. But it makes it just real simple where I can uh, pop it out, put the AC in. Like I said, everything's real portable, real easy to do. And uh, take it all down, I just gotta pull this out. And that's it. All right, I wanna thank you for watching BTR Outdoors. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Um, this was a, uh, a pretty neat uh, project that I wanted to get done. And, uh, cause I like going fishing, but it's been so hot here in Texas. And I love camping. So this way it gives me the opportunity to do that if I can find a place with electricity, which there's a lot of places around here. But if you want to see me go camping this thing, which I'm going to, um, just let me know. And like always, if you hit that subscribe button, that really helps me out a lot. So until the next video, um, we'll catch you later. And thank you for watching. Y'all have a good one.